In this video, we're going to look at how you can get more than 100 free nature assets. And they're all uh, pretty high quality too. Um, in the background, you can see a little example of the trees I'm using. So I'll tell you how you can get them, but first I'll tell you a little bit about them. First, we have these free assets from MaxTree, uh, which I'm gonna explain later how you can get them, or you can look at the timestamps below. Uh, there are assets which you can drag and drop in, and they are all very high quality. There's trees, bushes, uh, plants, grass, and a little bit more, uh, all for free and drag and droppable into Blender. Then we have Botanic, open up the end panel and you can find this Botanic assets with a lot of different nature assets. For the first one, the trees, you have two uh, free trees that we can use because this is the free version, the rest is locked. And we have this uh, second one with five free trees, uh, which you can all just uh, put into Blender with a single click. And these are also very high quality models, but not as high as the uh, Max Tree ones. So I think you can use these better if you're going for a very uh, large sheen. Um, there's a bunch of different nature models, like I said, like uh, grass and ivy and flowers and a lot more. Then we also have Blender Kit and I will put the link for Bl Blender Kit uh, in the description and I have this other video with uh, 10,000 free assets. So definitely check that out if you want 10,000 plus free assets. To get the free version of Botanic, go to this Blender Market page, link in the description and you just have to click on the Botanic free. Uh, down below you could also get traffic which is uh, also from the makers of Botanic with cars and such, basically the same thing but then with cars. So definitely check out their whole page. And once you have bought it and um, got the add-on and you've got it um, downloaded and put into a folder so, so that you then can do your preferences, add-on and then install it. Don't forget to enable it by clicking on the checkbox, not on this one though, on the one from Botanic on your screen, and then you'll have Botanic. Click on the M panel and you can get started. For the Max Tree assets, you have to go to their website, li uh, link down below, and click on the free asset. Select Blender as your format and add it to your cart. Go through the steps of buying it, which I'm not going to show, uh, but it's pretty straightforward. You do have to fill in some things, but I think it's worth it. Once downloaded, put it into a folder, a folder that you can easily find and go to this page um, for the asset browser and then select the folder where you have all of your uh, Blender files in from the Max tree. Now Blender knows that there could be an asset in these Blender files. Now you can go into one of the blend, uh, one of the blend files and right click on the, on the object um, and then you can mark it as an asset. Then it will automatically show up into your asset browser. Um, you do have to save the scene though. So after you have marked it as an asset, Ctrl S and you will be good. Fastest way to do this is probably to go into your folder and control click a couple of blend files, so uh, five or six of them, and then right click and open in Blender. So uh, Blender opens it all at once, all of these files. Then you can go in and right click all of the objects and mark as assets and save it uh, one by one, and that will go a lot quicker. To go into your asset browser, click the little icon right here and open up your asset browser. By default, the F uh, asset browser will be on current file that will be for the, um, uh, for the assets that will be in the current file, but there are none in mine. So I'll have to go to nature assets. That's what I called mine. And uh, then you can start dropping them in. That will be it for this video. Thank you for watching. I hope it helped. Um, if it did help you, maybe consider liking the video and subscribing for more videos like this. There will also be a, a video coming up where I explain how you can make realistic scenes with these assets. 
and also with the assets from the other video where with the 10,000 plus assets so definitely stay tuned for that uh, comment if you want to see anything else and uh, thanks for watching bye